All right, friends, these are our new Bridget denim, and I love these so much. I kept these as soon as I tried them on. I feel like a million dollars. I love them so much. So they have a four button detail. They are like a light to medium wash. They have a tiny bit of distressing throughout. They have some here and then throughout here. And then the ankle is like a full fringe detail all the way around. I am obsessed. They have a 10 and a half inch rise. They hit well above my belly button. I just love these so much and they look so good with our lot of clogs. This was my date night outfit. I'm obsessed. So I grabbed a size 11 in these. So these are Can Can brand. Um, a typical size throughout Can Can has been a nine and I prefer the 11 in these. They're like a more like structured denim feel. Like they still have all of the stretch and amazingness as all of our other denim do. They're Ninja Kick approved. However, they just like have a more like structured feel. So the nine was really tight and then I didn't get that full 10 and a half inch rise. So I'm gonna suggest that if you are like a nine, like or whatever size you are, seven, 15, whatever, and it's a little bit loose, like your normal size, then I would stick to your true to size. If your like normal size is a bit um, like fitted and you're like, no, this is what size I am, I couldn't afford to size down, then I would consider sizing up. So hopefully that makes sense. If you have questions, let me know. If you've never tried or done them before, you're missing out because it's amazing. So I'm typically like a 10, 12 in the store and these um, I fit in the and so if you're like a four six in the store I would um, consider a seven or a five depending on what size like you would typically lean towards so they are amazing you guys I'm so obsessed with them we have them in sizes 3 through 15 and they're $45